a mix of Verizon's HTC Droid DNA and the flagship HTC One, the HTC Butterfly S has just arrived at our office and it's time for a quick unboxing video. This is Victor with Phone Arena. Let's take a look. First, the box of the HTC Butterfly S looks like any other HTC box. You see the HTC One has a similarly shaped sized uh, box, <clears throat> nothing unusual. You see all the writing here is in Chinese. Why is that? That's because the phone is mainly for the Pacific Asian market and it will also arrive in some European markets. And right here on the box you see HTC Blink Feed, HTC Boom Sound and HTC Zoe. Some signature features coming first in the HTC One and now we see them in the HTC Butterfly S. So this device is, it really is a mixture and uh, let's mention once again it's targeting the Pacific Asia market so it's not really uh, on any US carrier you can only buy it unlocked in the United States and opening the box you find the handset itself we'll just put take a quick look and put this aside for a better look later on so let's explore what's inside the box uh, take the cover off and you see First, a SIM ejector tool that's kind of glued to the user menu here. It's all in Chinese, as we said, and we have a safety and regulatory guide in English. In bags on the side, there is a micro USB to USB cable, and we have headphones in red, and that's the wall charger. So basically a wall charger, headphones, and the micro USB cable, that's all that's inside the box. There is nothing left. So it's now time to put all of this to the side and fire up the handset itself. We've already powered it on since it's in Chinese, so we had to set it up. Um, and we've changed the settings to English. As you can see, it's a fairly thick device. Feels nice, solid in the hand, has some weight to it. And it's plastic, none of the aluminum unibody magic that we saw in the HTC One. It's a plastic affair, very similar in design to the HTC Droid DNA, but once again we said it's a mixture between the HTC One and the Droid DNA. You see the stereo speakers, boom sound right here. And at first sight it all looks very smooth, very nice. We'll be taking a deeper look in, a, uh, in an in-depth review that's coming up soon, so stay tuned with Phone Arena. And thanks for watching.